what is poppin people we are back with rejuvenation where love lies now this is i guess a spinoff or or a uh side game i should say that was made to show us how kita and talia met and this is the story of how they met so there's some things about this game we should talk about first, but before we get into that, if you guys have been enjoying the Rejuvenation series as a whole, I kind of like that they made a little side game. I've never seen that before in the fan game. Um, so I don't know how many people they have working on Rejuvenation, but this seems pretty cool, you know? Mm. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. So um, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe if you guys are enjoying these playthroughs. But uh, this game right here apparently has a regular ending and a true ending. We're gonna try to get the true ending. It's a little different though, because I'm reading it on the website. It says, this is the story of how Kata met Tal Talia. Um, they worked really hard on it, um, but I wanna know how to get the true ending. So I'm gonna follow a guide when I play this game because it says that I should follow a guide if I intend to get the true ending. And we obviously want the true ending. Um, and it seems like we can't actually catch Pokemon in this game but we need to obtain all the Pokemon in order to get the true ending. So I have the guide up on this side. I'm gonna link the game and the guide uh, in the description for you guys if you wanna play along. Um, but it seems to get the true ending, we need to collect all available Pokemon, trigger the secret cutscene in chapter two, and collect the time capsule and the keys, whatever that means, I'm not quite sure. Uh, the guy that made this guide said he's not 100% sure if you need that, but he would suggest that we do it just so that we're safe. Um, so I have the guide up. I'm going to go through the options right now, actually, and change some stuff around. Uh, I want to make the game bigger. Here we go. All right. So we have that done. Let's go ahead and hop right into it. So assuming that, you know, what they said in the uh, description of the game, this is the story of how Kata met Talia. We're not actually going to be playing as our character. We're going to be playing as Kenneth or Kita, or whatever he goes by in this game. Because I know his name was Kenneth before he became Kita. Something like that. And it says that you don't actually need to play this game in order to understand the main story, but I'm thinking that if you do play this game, we'll, we'll understand a little bit more the relationship between Kata and uh, Talia. We're all gonna miss you. Yeah, it'll be a lot less fun on the island without you, bro. Who will I get into trouble with when Nana finds out I've been messing around again? <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, please, Klaus. Don't act like Kenneth leaving is going to stop you from doing all that stuff anyway. Isn't that right, Kenneth? Don't bring him into this. Well, you're not entirely wrong, Jenny. But he's totally not my problem anymore, so make sure he behaves for me, yeah? Oh, no, I don't think you're going to throw this lug on me like that. But but if that's what you want me to do, then I guess it's fine. We'll all be rooting for you, you know? You're finally taking responsibility, and it's making your old grandpappy proud. I know, and I won't let any of you down. I'll do my best. With Lucario by my side, anything's possible, you know? Well, I guess it's time for us to head out, buddy. The ferry's leaving soon. And you were just gonna leave without saying goodbye to your old mama? I didn't raise you this way, you know? Oh, shoot. Mama, I'm, I'm sorry I didn't tell you right away. <sighs> it's okay, mijo. <laughs> is, he, is he of Spanish descent? Is he Mexican? I know you have your reasons. And I support you no matter what you do. Remember that. Even when you're going so far away, I know that one day you'll return. I I will. I will return. By the way, where's Deegan? Your brother doesn't want to see you right now, Miho. I see. Don't worry about Deegan. I shall speak with him later. Have a good time and do your best, Kenneth. Goodbye, Mama. Grandpa. Before you leave, Kenneth, I have a parting gift for you. I already loaded it onto the ferry for you. I'm sure it will aid you. Thank you, Grandpa. Oh, I'm so tired. I keep yawning. I'm so sorry. Come, Lucario. It's time to leave. Uh. 
She's crying. No. My name is Kenneth. I was born on four islands of the Sevi Islands. Four island of the Sevi Islands, excuse me. I mostly just hang with my friends Klaus and Jenny all day. But besides those two, I have a mom and an older brother. I did have a father, but he passed away. My father loved to help people. He would go out of his way to save even the smallest Pokemon. Every day I think about how much of an impact he was on so many people's lives. I knew I wanted to be just like him ever since I was small. So to push that forward, I do many things in my free time. I help my mom and my older brother with chores around the island and the house. But other than that, I have absolutely no talent. You have a Lucario. Where'd that come from? I'm sure it's not easy to have a Lucario. 14 years ago, an apocalyptic disaster happened to a region far from Kanto. I was four when it happened, but even I knew the severity of that event. It was talked about for years, even today still. I wasn't there, but I used to have nightmares about it. Just looking at the sheer destruction triggered something within me. An uncontrollable feeling of despair and sadness. My mother used to wipe my tears and tell me that it's okay to feel sad once in a while. My older brother, Deegan, didn't feel the same way. He thought I was weak. But in those moments, I was weak. I was ashamed of my uselessness. But that changed the day I turned 18. It took more than a decade, but a support group ran by a man referred to as Mr. Blakery was constructed. Come on, come one, come all. The people of Avium are in need of your help. Help me build the land where all the people of Avium can live together in peace and harmony after such tragedy. His words moved and persuaded me almost instantly. It looked like they needed all the help they could get, so I, I applied. And I got accepted. That's where I'm headed now to that faraway region named Avium. Can I know how you got your Lucario though? I don't know what I'll find there, but I know once I get there, I'll finally feel a relief. I'll help everyone and anyone I can. That's what I was born to do. Gear and city, here I come. That's a fast boat all of a sudden. Can I run now? Oh no, I can't. Hey kid, we made it to that Garen City place. It was a rough journey, but we made it in the end, thank Arceus. Just get your stuff and hop on out of here. Th thank you. Ah, didn't Grandpa say that he had a parting gift for me? I should probably take a look around and find it. Okay, so now I can move. Alright, so Pokemon level 10? There ain't no fucking way you have a level 10 Lucario. And it's docile. Trash. What moves does it have? Ores for poison jab detect. That's not bad. And it's shiny too. Kenneth. Alright. Just taking again. He only has 1500 bucks. This has to be it, right? I mean, it has four Kenneth on it. I'm such a joker. Huh, Lucario. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's a critic. Mystery egg. Okay, so we got another Pokemon. And it put it in the key I what? Wow, a Pokemon egg? He must have gotten it from the daycare. There haven't been any new trainers on the island, so must be a Pokemon that's native to Four Island then. Oh well. We'll see you soon enough. Let's get out of here. So that went to my key item slot? That's kinda weird, right? That's very weird. Key items are supposed to go I mean I'm uh, sorry, eggs are supposed to go to your party. Alright, so I'm looking at the guide. And in this first chapter, we're supposed to get a Scyther, a Muck, or a Donphin. We have to talk to a guy standing on the right side next to the water. After you get kicked out of the manager's office. Okay, hold on. I want to spoil that. I'll, figure, I'll, get, to, I'll get to that once I get there. But um, we do need to get a Pokemon for this first part. What else do we need to do? It seems like that's it. Time capsule. There's a time capsule we got to grab, too. Okay, so... Get Scyther, Muck, or Donfin, and then get the time capsule. All right, so we're following the guide, like I said we would. Gear and City. So this is Gear and City. It looks so, um... 
not finished at all? Huh? Come on, Lucario. Let's go check what the city has. Can I run? Since we're new to the city, we should probably ask him a few things. Yep, I think that's the best course of action. Don't get shy on me now, Lucario. Um, excuse me, sir? May I ask you a question? The building you want is northwest. Uh huh? No, I was going to ask if this city was, um... You see, I applied for the Blakery Corps to rescue and help survivors of the tragedy 14 years ago. You know, you what now? Jeez, another one, huh? I'm sorry, but I don't really follow. That whole thing is just a stupid scam. You're not working on saving anyone or anything. They say that, but what they really want you to do is help build this gigantic city. Wh what? Mr. Blakery, or whatever, thinks this is the best way to help Avium. So in a way, they weren't really lying to you. Listen, why don't you just go to the main building and get set situated and see how things go? Things aren't that bad around here. Maybe you might like it. Uh, I mean, okay, sure. Come on, Lucario. By the way, he's gonna need these. Golden Sash. Exper why is he giving me an experience all? Item finder? Lemon... This man's way too hospitable. I can really have all of this stuff? Don't look at me like that, kid. I'm not the generous one here. That's just the starter pack given to all the new workers here. You can't exactly break rocks or push boulders without any badges, am I right? That gold sash has you covered with all that stuff. Ah, gotcha. Thank you. Oh, and one last thing. You better be prepared to battle while walking around the city. A lot of the workers here get bored and battle each other during breaks. Keep an eye out. Uh, okay, got it. It's been a while since we really battled someone other than Deegan, Lucaria. But I'm sure we can do it if we really try our best. So this is when he was, uh... He's 18 now, right? And obviously in the story we know, he's a grown-ass man. What am I doing here? I'm trying to see what that golden sash was that he gave me. A sash that allows the user to use any HM without the need of badges, huh? Turning off the special device was done, okay. I didn't find it. Alright, so let's go find... I can't run yet. That sucks. So I need to talk to the worker on the right here. It's this guy right here. I don't understand why I gotta do so much work. Why can't our Pokemon do any everything? I just want to take a nap. And I dropped my union ID while doing my job too. That's a real bummer. I hope you find it soon. I don't. Oh. Well, okay then. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, so we gotta go. He said northwest or northeast. Can't go through. Damn, cuz. All right, well, uh, tell us the battle. Hey, I just saw you get off that boat. That must mean you're new, right? Yeah, I'm new, so battle me. I have ore sphere, though. That's a very strong move for a level 10 Pokemon, that's for sure. Wish I had a good nature, though. Sweet scent, hello. So we're using potions. Okay, what was that? Uh, okay, never mind. I read it wrong. Shit. Oops. Yikes, sorry, I didn't expect it to be so strong. 
I guess you shouldn't assume a man's strength by his newbiness. <laughs> Rest center. Was this a Pokemon center? Oh, clean. Right, so if I need to heal, I can come back over here. Nice to know, nice to know. All right, so we're going northwest or northeast? Why don't you just walk in front of me? What the hell? What's your problem? You're not doing shit. What the fuck? What's with all these psychic Pokemon when I have a fighting type? This is no coincidence. Don't hit that. What the fuck? Wake up. Come on. Wake up! Thank you, Lucario. Let me switch out. <laughs> Why'd you beat up my Pokemon? What the hell? Who the hell are you, kid? Why are you so annoying? Dude, what the fuck did I do? All right, so, going this way. Where's the management office? Who's that guy? Aw, oh, there you are, Jenner. Jenner? Oh, shit. What are you doing all the way over here? I'm meditating to, my, to myself because I've realized life has no meaning. Ugh, I know, preach it, brother. And then we have all these normies walking around and building this huge city. These damn conformists, they enrage me. Yeah, well, let them enrage a fire out of you because I need to smoke, yeah? Chastity, smoking is bad for your health. I won't allow it. Ugh, that, that's conformist talk. Is this place already getting to you? I'm not a conformist, I'm a realist. Why doesn't anyone understand me? Oh my god. Jenner, just look at this conformist. Oh my god. They're enraging my devil's hand. They will know my true fury. Where did you come from, Normie? Hoenn? What? No, I came from Kanto. <laughs> I fucking knew it. This is discrimination. But she guessed completely wrong. Anyway, we don't have time for you, Normie. We're waiting on my bro boyfriend, Matthew, to come back and confirm a gig for us. We're all in a band, you see. We're gonna be super famous one day. Uh, I didn't see, man, fuck, man. <laughs> I was conformed to society's normal. Hey, maybe we, we might remember you and give you an autograph or something. What's your name, anyway? It's Kenneth, and has anyone ever told you that you're insufferable? Because to tell you the truth, I think I lost 10 years from this conversation. <laughs> Damn, Normie, that's some mighty big talk from a redneck like you. I like, totally like you, Kendrick. We should totes hang out sometime, you know, from a distance. It's Kenneth, and I think I'll pass. See you, Kenneth. What's up, Joe, man? What's wrong, man? What's wrong, man? Oop, didn't mean to do that. Hey, I see you got back from the store, son. Did you get what I needed? <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about. So maybe, I don't know if the interaction was uh, significant or not. But I guess we'll find out, right? Thanks for having two Pokemon that are weak to fighting moves. I appreciate that. You're not my son. You're not my dad. Mind if we battle? I'm really bored. See, that's better. No weird shit there. Thanks for having Pokemon that are weak to fighting moves. I appreciate all of you. See, that's a fucking Patrat. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Thanks, I'm still bored. <laughs> Rest center. Another one? Oh, there's so many of these. The other one's not even that far away. Kids now? What is this world coming to? I'm 18 though, right? Mika's coffee. Did I not go the right way? I shouldn't mess around here. I need to find that main building. Just went the wrong way. It's gotta be up those stairs there. Hey, this mansion is only for certified workers. I'm not certified, so I guess I'm not allowed. Okay, I guess I'm not there then. The fuck is this place, yeah? Am I crazy? Who the fuck's the main building, yo? Where have I not gone? I'm pretty sure I've gone everywhere. Where the fuck have I not gone? gone yet. This is also a rest center. He said the door was locked. You went to the main building? Well, let me stop you there. Okay, so it's there. me man and then use a ground move what kind of dick are you there's a big dick there man do I have any potions I've eliminated Quit your job so my wages will increase. Yeah, I was gonna say, that's definitely not how it works. All right, so we, go, we know where we're supposed to go now. I'm gonna do that one more time. I'm like a fun Pokemon, I gotta make sure he's healthy. I'm gonna come down here. Who are you? 
Pokeballs haven't been imported to the Avian region after the Calamity. Because of this, you really won't find chocolate Pokeballs. It's difficult for, for trainers, but this region isn't really for that kind of stuff anyway. Plus, Mr. Blakery provides Pokemon to people who need them. Oh, this guy. I'm a milk, ice heal, antidote. Lucario can't get poisoned, so I don't need that yet. Alright, so we found the main building. And it auto saved us now. <laughs> Reception. Um, hello? Okay, well, she's ignoring me. Sorry, but this complex is for workers only. I guess I need to go to the main building to get myself completely ready for the first time. That would be correct, sir. What? Where the fuck is the main building? How is this not the main building? Here we go. Beat it, kid. Don't waste time and stand around. But I need to find the guy in charge of all this. I think there's been some kind of mistake. What? You want to talk to Mr. Blakery himself? Good luck with that, kid. The only one in Gearin right now is his manager. If you're looking to talk to him, he went on his lunch break. Should be around Nika's Coffee or something like that. Well, all right. I'm still head there now. Okay, that's why they didn't let me in there the first time. I found it. It's up here. There's no signs anywhere. And don't come back until you bring in actual customers. Youch! That hurts so bad. You didn't have to push me. Oh my gosh. You didn't see that, did you? That's so embarrassing. Didn't see a thing. Oh, you're a gentleman, you know that? Thanks for that. I really appreciate it. Rough day at work, I assume? Yeah, but don't worry. I get kicked out at least twice a day. I'm so sorry. Hey now, don't you worry about it. It brings in the money, so it's fine. The name's Tesla. What's yours? <laughs> it's fucking Tesla. <laughs> My name's Kenneth. I'm from Kanto. Wow, really? That's really far from here. I'm from here, but I'm not so interesting. But that's okay. Say, it's kind of refreshing to see a normal person around these parts. Everyone here is, well, all quirky and stuff that it becomes draining. Yeah, I've only been in the city for a little while and I've already met some interesting characters. Ah, well ain't that cute. They're weird, but we're all harmless. If you say so, then I guess I'll believe you. Right, well, I won't get in your way any longer. I'm sure you came up here for a reason. Presumably a cup of coffee, right? Actually, I came here to meet with the manager of the construction project. <sighs> You're here to see Keith? Well, he's... Your employer, and you should watch what you say around him. Anyway, I have to go now, but it was nice meeting you, Kenneth. We should talk again once I'm off duty or something. Oh, I think they like me. Uh, oh, sure. So you wanted to talk to me or something? Yes, I'm here to talk about my employment. I signed up because the application said I'd rescue and aid the residents of Avian. And I want to do my best to help, but... But what? People from this region have to find somewhere to live, right? Well, with a couple of bank loans and soul stealing, they too can have a moderately sized, overpriced condo. That's not what I mean. Listen, if you want to talk more, come meet me in my office. I can't talk about confidential stuff out here in the open. I'd lose my job. What was the point of me running around the city? Literally no point. Can I go in here now? Lucario, why is everyone in this city insufferable? <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. At least Tesla was nice. Come on, bud. We better go talk to this asshole and see if he'll actually help. I still can't go in here. What the fuck? What's the point? Now we go back down here to a place we just came from for no reason. All of that was unnecessary. They could have just let us right in. Oh, excuse me. Pokemon must be within their Pokeballs while in the building. Thank you. Oh. Sorry, Lucario. You gotta go for now. Elizabeth, I told you that we can't be seen in this office after we... After you what? Um, don't worry about it, kid. Now, what can Keith do for you today? I want an explanation. I thought this was supposed to be a program to help people of Avium. 
Yeah, that's exactly what we're doing. How is building a city going to help the city and the citizens of Avium? Well, like I said, people got to find a new place to live after their land was destroyed, right? And where do you expect them to get the money to pay for these apartments? What about the people living in poverty? What happens to them? Eh, something will happen. They'll rise back. They usually do. But if you're done complaining, we need work to get done. We're not even one third of the way done. And this place needs to be stuffed with people by next month, so... Leave. I'm not leaving. Fine, stay there until security eventually comes to escort you out of the building. Is this a map of the region? Yes, it's exactly that. What of it? Hmm. Or there's actually something interesting about this. There's a town east of this part of the city, yeah? It's circled. What are your plans with this area? Huh? Oh, that's the place that used to be Sheridan Village. We haven't got any sign of life in that area since the tragedy, so we're probably going to clear it all out. Mr. Blakery is very interested in turning it into a resort of some kind. Not sure. Let me go there and scope out the area. Wh what? <laughs> Don't make me laugh, kid. That's uncharted territory and off-limits to workers here. It's, if it's off-limits, then I quit. Qu quit? Okay, then. That's fine. Security! Wait, what? S security? Huh? But we can just talk about this, right? It was just a misunderstanding, haha. <laughs> oh, god damn it. H hey, come on, fellas. This is just one big misunderstanding. And do you have to be so aggressive? You're hurting my arm, for Christ's sake. Hey, let me go already. W wait, wait! And please, don't come back. I... I may have acted a bit rashly. <laughs> oh, I got thrown out like jazz. I, I just realized I have nowhere to stay now that I don't have a job. Yikes. <sighs> I really need to work on my haggling. I didn't actually want to quit my job, but I gotta wonder if I would have been fired if I didn't quit. He was pretty quick to accept my resignation. Almost like he didn't mind if I did or not. Not to mention housing is only provided to workers in the company. Yeah, I hear you, bud. I was hoping to soak this egg Grandpa gave me in warm water to help it hatch. But that's pretty much out of the question now, which is unfortunate. Damn it all. I'm not just gonna give up so easily. I can't go back just yet. Even if I can't do anything to help here, I'm not gonna go home just yet. We're gonna go to Sheridan Village, and we're gonna help out anyone we can. Keith said there were no signs of life, but maybe that's not true. Maybe people are actually in need of my help. Somewhere out there. But first, we should probably find a place to sleep for the night, yeah? Let's get back to the small pier. Maybe one of the workers there may have a couch we could sleep on? Okay, so this is the first part. I gotta talk to this guy right here. Are you perhaps sure to sign up for a field? A field? That's correct. Each employee who enters a field gets a free Pokemon to help aid their task. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but I'm... Excuse me one moment. <laughs> Did you hear that, Lucario? A free Pokemon. I mean, I'm still an employee to this guy, right? So that means I can get a free Pokemon out of this deal, right? Why are you looking at me like that? Come on, it's not that big of a deal. I'm sure they have plenty of Pokemon in reserve. Fine, ignore me then. I'm gonna get myself a free Pokemon. Yeah, I'll take one of each, please. Whoa, slow down there, kid. You're only eligible to apply for one field. Oh, okay, well, what are the fields then? Before I go into detail, I need to see our union ID. Never mind. <laughs> I don't have a union ID. Hey, don't laugh at me. That was a very unfortunate situation. I won't be able to get another Pokemon unless I get a worker's ID. Since I'm no longer an employee, Keith won't give me one. Maybe we can get our hands on one another way? Hey, let's take a look around and see what we can find. All right, so this is the first part where we need to find the union ID. So that guy lost his, and this guy's telling us we need a union ID to get a free Pokemon. So go back to the worker who lost the union ID. I'll mention where he lost it. All right, cool. Let's do that. Then you gotta go around the long way. 
What the? What the hell do you mean we don't have a gig? Huh? Explain, Matthew. Uh-oh. Explain yourself now, Matthew. Ouchie, owie. You're not supposed to hit me until after I explain. So I gotta confess, we never had a gig here, like ever. I just told you guys I had a gig so that you would come down here with me. If the reason is not suitable, my death hand will destroy you, Matthew. L listen, we were all tired of living with our lame parents, right? Well, this was a free way to move out and get free housing. It was the perfect deal. Don't be a conformist, Matthew. Nothing's ever free. There's a catch to all of this, I'm sure. Out with it, tell us! So in exchange for our free housing and trip away from our parents, we gotta help build the city. Matthew, say it isn't so. Say it isn't so. My death hand. I cannot control. Oh, sauce K ass nigga. Wait, guys, this is a good deal. What happened? Yikes. That guy is gonna feel that for a few days. Maybe I shouldn't go that way for a little while. Wait, the guy who was blocking the way isn't there anymore. Isn't that place supposed to be some luxurious mansion? That's gotta be a better, there's gotta be a better something in there, right? Well, Lucario, let's go take a look. <laughs> okay, well, well, we'll do that later. Uh, I gotta talk to this guy over here first. Excuse me, sir, but could I talk to you for a sec? Huh? What do you want from me? I'm trying to drink my problems away. Can't you see that? Relax, I was just going to ask you about your union ID. What? My union ID? Bleh. I lost my ID a long time ago. You lost it? Yeah, I lost it. I don't really care that I did anyway. Um, if I find your union ID, can I have it? Fine, sure, whatever. I sure as hell don't want it. <laughs> Why doesn't he want his ID? <laughs> Sweet, do you remember where you lost it? It was near a small stream of water. I think just north of here? That's the last place I saw it anyway. Great, thanks. Yeah, yeah. All right, so I think we gotta go north now, obviously, because we just said that. And uh, let's see what we find up there. I think it's here, right? <laughs> He's holding a Maxterville in his hand. Huh? What's this? Hey! that work is union ID. We can use this to obtain a free Pokemon. Clean. And so now let's get our Pokemon. Still going to need that union ID. I got your ID right here. Hmm. Yes, yes. This is an ID, alright? Alright. You're going to actually look at it? Kid, I don't get paid enough to be completely observant all the time. I see an ID and that's all I need to see. Well, all right then, no complaints for me. Now to explain the three fields. There are three fields you may enter. The infrastructure field, which is paving roads. There's a def deforestation field. We need to chop down trees for our expansion. And finally, we have a waste management. I think that one is self-explanatory. Which Pokemon do you get for eat for which? For deforestation, we supply Scyther. For waste management, we supply Muck. Finally, for infrastructure, we supply Donphin. Hmm. I think I want Donphin. Okay, here you go. One Donphin coming up. Awesome. This guy will do wonders on my team. Now to explain your role. Nah, that's fine. I got it. <laughs> Alright, Lucario, let's give our new team member a spin. I I feel swindled. <laughs> As he should. <laughs> Alright, so we got our first Pokemon, and then the Time Capsule. The Time Capsule can be obtained in Vitus's old mansion, but it can only be collected before you go to Tesla's apartment for the night. You will find the capsule on a rock. Our item finder didn't detect it, so use the image shown. In the room where you encounter Behem. Alright, so let's go up to the mansion then. 
apparently we might need that. Uh, how do I get there? This way, right? Hey, check this place out. Remember this mansion? It's a pretty opulent place. But there's also something kinda, I don't know, ominous? Maybe it's haunted for something. Or something, excuse me. What? What is this place? It's so depressing. Is that dried blood? Lucario, I don't think this is a very happy place. I get the feeling something really terrible happened here. Oh, he doesn't even know, man. Whether that had been recently or a long time ago, that bad feeling feels real present. Let's look around a bit more. Yep, look at this. Yep, yeah, we've all seen this painting. Shit happened here, my boy. Whoa, this room is amazing. the fucking totem from that island. <laughs> Somehow this place feels worse than upstairs. <laughs> Do we really want to stay down here for the night? Looks like a place you'd get your soul sacrificed or something. Psh, I'm just joking. That doesn't happen. That's what you think, guy. Look at this shit, dude. We're looking for the time capsule. There's an image that shows where it is in here. Looks like it's over here somewhere. Are we in a battle in here? Let's look at our Donphin too, by the way. I don't think I looked at it yet. It's a little 18. Careful nature, that's not too bad. Bulldoze, horn attack, fire fang roll. I'll take it. all of this this room is pretty quaint a little cold but we can deal for at least one night right whoa this pit goes down a long way lucaria let's find a place to sleep that's not at all close to the to the railing but what do you think this place was used for huh like really what's what's a twisted place like this doing underneath the mansion i guess it doesn't really matter it's a story that will never be told I just can't shake the feeling that I shouldn't be here. I know I've already said that plenty of times before, but it's true. Maybe we should go just go, yeah, Lucario? Maybe. Huh? Lucario, did you just... <laughs> Lucario's gone. L Lucario? Where'd you go, buddy? Th this isn't the time to pull any pranks. This place is too freaky. Please, help me. The little girl. Is that, um... What was her name? I forgot. I know it starts with an M. Please, help me! Hold on. I'll try to get you down from there. If you don't help me, I'll... I'll... I'll be lost. No! I fell down the hole. That's crazy. Ah! A am I dreaming? All of this can't be real. I will be lost without you. Is that Vivian? You'll be lost without me. What does that even mean? Please. I'll, I'll help you now. Just tell me how. How can I help you? It's a fucking Bahiam. A Pokemon? Are you causing all this? If so, I'll have to deal with you myself. I don't have Lucario anymore though, right? Oh, I do have Lucario. 
Why'd they act like he disappeared if he was here the whole time? Damn, I kind of wish I had Detect right now. <laughs> Swords dance, beautiful. Thank you. Is this Vivian or Talia? Ugh, what's... Seriously? Where am I now? This is getting old. Hey, isn't that? That's the girl who was trapped in that crystal. At least, I think. This is kind of crazy. H hello? Oh, Kenneth. You already know my name? Have we met somewhere before? Perhaps in another life? Another time? What are we both doing here? I needed to talk to you, Kenneth. But I couldn't find a way. At least, not until now. I need you to help me. To help us. You keep asking for help, but not replying how. I want to help you. This was the entire reason I came to this region. So please, tell me how I can. I want you to find me, and when you do, I want you to give me this. Bro, what? <laughs> what kind of shit? <laughs> find me and give me this. What is this, an amulet? It was handed down to me by a relative. It's very important to me, and only you can give this to me. So please, Kenneth. I said please. So please, Kenneth, find me. Because if you don't, I won't last. My life is in your hands. D don't worry, I'll find you. I'll find you and I'll save you. It's a promise from me to you. I promise. Thank you. Are you going to question any of this or? Uh... Cario. Huh? Lucario, was that really you? Was that all a dream? It must have been. Wait, the amulet that girl gave me. I still have it, which means... Lucario, how long have I been out? Oh, wait, that's right. I can't understand what you're saying. <laughs> I'm only teasing you, Lucario. You don't have to give me those deadly eyes of yours. Really, though, we should leave and also never come back. Because this place has probably emotionally scarred me for the rest of my life. How about you? Yeah, that's what I thought. Your aura is horribly tainted. Let's get out of here, buddy. I didn't get the time capsule! Oh, no. It's already nighttime? That means all the workers up by, uh, by the pier have already gone home. What the fuck is that? I didn't see anywhere that looked like that. Fuck. When you... In the room where you encounter Bihia, but I didn't have any chance to uh, go back and get it. Can I go back? Maybe I can go back. Another day bites the dust. To a better day tomorrow. Kenneth? What are you doing out here so late? Oh, hey Tesla. How's it going? Mind if I sit with you? Sure, take a seat. Awesome. Man, got hose already? No, I'm playing. So what are you doing out here by yourself at, the at this time of day? Oh, you know, just hanging around, I guess. Really? I thought you would have been really tired from all that physical labor. Some of the people that walk into the shop at the end of the day can barely walk. I I'm sorry, was that a bit presumptuous and rude of me? N no, you're fine. That's not it. Actually, it ties into me being out here at night. <laughs> oh? It's complicated, but... You see, the thing is, I kind of accidentally quit my job. Y you what? You quit? 
I didn't mean to. I was just trying to haggle my boss. I came to this region to help people, not build a city. I was trying to get him to send me somewhere else, but he didn't want to budge. So I threatened to quit and he kind of rolled over me with it and kicked me out. Keith did that? I'm so sorry. Yeah. But it doesn't matter. Tomorrow morning I'm going to leave this place and head for Sheridan Village. I will help as many people as I possibly can, no matter what. I'm sorry if this was wrong, but is it your dream? Is what my dream? You know, helping people out who really need it. Oh, I guess it is. I think I got it from my dad. He was always eager to help people out. Unfortunately, he died during one of his jobs. I'm so sorry about that. It's okay, he died doing what he loved. It's a little funny though. My mama always said I was born with unnatural amount of empathy. But sometimes I feel like the average person isn't born with enough. Ha ha ha, I second that. So what's your dream? M my dream? Well, I guess it's not really a dream, but one day I want to own an orphanage. Wait, seriously? Yeah, you see, I'm actually an orphan myself, so... R really? Yeah, my parents died in an accident a long time ago. I never really knew them, so I don't really know how to feel about them. But owning an orphanage takes a lot of time and money. That's why I'm here, you know? Mika's coffee must really pay you well if you're working there to build an orphanage. Haha, <laughs> very funny, Kenneth. I'm only working here part-time. I'm trying to become a model. I hear they make big bucks. A model, you say? Yep, I applied and everything. Just gotta wait on a reply. If I'm honest, I'm scared to death. If this doesn't work out, then... I think you'd be a really good model. I think you're really pretty. Okay! He's trying to get in there! W what? D don't say such a silly thing. Okay, well, if you didn't think you were pretty, why'd you try to become a model in the first place? You must know that you're somewhat attractive, right? Uh, I'm sorry, was that weird to say? What was that? Th that would be my stomach. I haven't eaten since, well, yesterday. You haven't eaten since yesterday? Today's practically over. Uh, yeah, I guess it is. I'm sorry, but this just won't do. Come with me right now. They don't give you a lot to uh, do in this game. Sit. Um, is it okay for me to be in Mika's Cafe break room? Absolutely not, but no one's here at the moment, so who cares? Now sit. Okay. Now you wait right here. I'll be right back. She whipping up in the kitchen. She whipping them pots. Squirtle and Bulbasaur, I'm water whipping. Do you guys get it? Squirtle and Bulbasaur, I'm water whipping. <laughs> Woo! It's dinner. Isn't that obvious? Now eat up. Th thank you so much. I made it with love, so make sure you enjoy it. It's absolutely delicious. Are you sure this is all right? Just eat up, okay? I don't want to hear any more talking. Haha, <laughs> I didn't even know Mika's coffee served food like this. Uh huh? We don't serve food. Then where'd this plate come from? Oh, that? Don't worry. That's just my lunch for tomorrow. Hey! What? But if I eat this now, you won't have any lunch for tomorrow. Pfft, it's fine. Besides, you said you're leaving tomorrow, right? Just take it as a farewell gift, okay? Don't ask any more questions. Uh, okay, gotcha. Listen, Tesla, thank you so much for the meal. It was delicious. Oh, hey, don't worry about it. It was the least I could do. And look, I bet you're real tired of seeing me, but you don't have a place to stay tonight, yeah? Huh? How'd you know that? Well, the housing here is only for people working to rebuild the city. And seeing as you no longer have a job here, I'm guessing you never got your apartment key. Haha, <laughs> you're too smart for me, Tesla. Why don't you stay over at my place for the night? Ooh, he getting in there. He is getting in there. He's about to dive in. Oh, splash. I just realized that uh, my frame rate is uh, 60 FPS. And it's going to make the file size of this video gigantic, but that's fine. Fuck me, right? <laughs> if you'd have me, I'd be really grateful. I didn't get to see what that said. West of the main building. You can't miss it. Oh, my apartment, apartment is 7B. Don't forget. 7B got it. <laughs> see you soon. Lucario, I don't think I've met anyone as nice as Tesla before. <laughs> I said Tesla, Tesla before in my life. This is gonna be our only night in Garden City, so let's finish up anything we haven't. All right, so now we're gonna go get the time capsule. 
Tesla's so nice. It's crazy how she's that nice and her daughter's a fucking bitch. Ain't it? Ain't it crazy? Alright, so. We're supposed to. And here, I think, is where the time capsule is. There it is. Huh? This thing has no way to open it. It's a time capsule, so maybe it won't open for a while. Better not think about it right now. Alright, so we got the time capsule. Surprised he didn't say anything about coming back in here. Considering he didn't want to come back in here. Alright, so the main building is down here. Apartment building is over here. West of the. She said west of the main building, right? It's gotta be here then. Alright, we're gonna save the game here, guys. We'll be back tomorrow with another episode of this. I actually kinda like this, though. It's a change of pace, but it's welcome. <laughs> Goodbye! Hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, or else.